Hi everybody. So if you've been following along with my Asus router video series, you will have seen a number of videos to make your router more secure. So today I'm going to show you how to add an additional layer of security to stop any unauthorized logging to your router web interface. So let's dive straight in. So head over to your router's main interface page as I've done here and enter your login credentials. Once you've logged in on the left hand side, look at the menu system and go right to the bottom to administration and left click on that and then select the system tab. Once on the system tab, you wanna scroll right down to the bottom of the page. Once you're at the bottom, you wanna look for enable access restrictions and click on yes. What this allows you to do is enter some an IP address or a range of IP addresses for devices that you want to be able to access your router's web interface and also to access uh, via an SSH uh, shell. So one of the things I would say before you go ahead and do this, make sure that the device you want to log into has got a fixed IP address. So if, you've, if you don't know how to do that, I have posted a video on how to do that. So take a look in the video description below or just have a look in my Asus video playlist. So let's carry on. So click on the drop down box and that's gonna open up all of the devices connected to your uh, router. I'm going to use my laptop for this example and there's the IP address and I'm going to restrict both web access and SSH and then just click on the uh, plus sign here so you've added it and then just simply click on apply and that's literally all you need to do. Once you've done that nothing else aside from that particular device with your login details and the IP address will be able to log in to your router. So that's gonna add now uh, a number of things that people need. They need your login uh, username, they need your login password, and they would need your IP address. So another little step to making your Asus router more secure. I hope you found that helpful. If you did, please consider subscribing and maybe even hitting that notification bell so we see each other in the next video. Take care, everybody.